listen, I hope you're doing well. Listen to this. Uh, Wells Fargo looks like they're at it again. This young girl, I'll let her go ahead and tell you what is going on. This angers me to my core. So we need to support her. And here we go. Hi, my name is Zoe. I'm 12 years old, and I'm the CEO of Beautiful Curly Me. This weekend, Wells Fargo closed and emptied our business accounts, leaving us with zero dollars. They closed our account saying that we did not have a physical office address when we had the office on there that we've been using for years. So that is simply untrue. How are we supposed to function without any cash? Through Beautiful Curly Me, I create dolls, books, and puzzles like Bella here to help inspire confidence in young black and brown girls. I also give one doll away for every doll purchase and my dolls recently launched on Target. A bank is supposed to support and help small businesses, not suppress us. Mm -hmm. And we really, really need your support to get through this time. Please, if you can, go to beautifulkalimi.com and purchase one of our products and help us get through this rough time. We really, really appreciate it. Thank you for your support. We are under attack. The fearless fun. Now this young fearless black woman here. News flash. We not. We're gonna keep on fighting, ladies. Uh, -uh. we we don't just go down like that. I'm making my order today. Matter of fact, we need to all call Wells Fargo. Yeah, I was trying to get her location, like see what's location. But uh, this right here. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be calling. I'm gonna even call from a uh business line. Wells Fargo. This is not acceptable. They want this young lady to fail. Let's see. Wells Fargo customer service. Uh, I see an 800 number of Wells Fargo. 1-800-869-3557. I will be calling Wells Fargo. I have a toll-free number. 1-800-869-3557. We are women. We will fight. Nah, nah. Uh, ladies, let's support this young woman if you can. Again, Wells Fargo, I'm going to call. We'd like some answers. 1-800-869-3557. So I will be calling them today. Yep, and I will be going to uh, Beautiful Curling Me. So one more time, why is our young princess, you have this up freezing her account. They froze her assets. What the hell? They froze her. Look on the screen. They froze her assets. So I think some phone calls need to be made. I'll be making mine. It's up to you to do what you're going to do. And we need to also support her. BeautifulCurlyMe.com. This is ridiculous. And I hope she's already lawyered up. Hi, my name is Zoe. I'm 12 years old and I'm the CEO of Beautiful Curly Me. This weekend, Wells Fargo closed and emptied our business accounts, leaving us with zero dollars. They closed our accounts, saying that we did not have a physical office address when we had the office on there that we've been using for years. So that is simply untrue. How are we supposed to function without any cash? Through Beautiful Curly Me, I create dolls, books, and puzzles like Bella here to help inspire confidence in young black and brown girls. I also give one doll away for every doll purchase, and my dolls recently launched on Target. Mm. A bank is supposed to support and help small businesses, not suppress us. And they're trying to suppress your dollar, but it's not going to work. So I'll be making my call. In the meantime, in between time, ladies, mothers, cousins, fathers, we got to support this young lady. So I'm assuming they've gotten a bank elsewhere. I'm sure, of course. I mean, seize her assets. So no, we need to go ahead and get some answers. I want some answers. I want some answers. So here is the website, beautifulcurlyme.com. Dolls, book, puzzles created by a girl to inspire confidence in other girls. Oh my God, I love her. She's a 12-year-old CEO. We cannot let her go down. We got to fight and fight with that darn pocketbook. Oh my gosh, I am, this is making me mad. So here it says you can shop community support sale. And she just launched in Target. It sounds like to me, based on what she's saying, there's a hater at Wells Fargo. Don't forget, that's the same creepy bank, how I see them, that made those what? Fake accounts, remember? But here, it appears to be a legitimate account and they frozen her assets. You first of all, you should have checked it out when she opened it up. No, it sounds like to me somebody might be looking for a reason to make a move like this here. Look at this website. 
Look at this. Beautiful Curly Me Bella doll. She's got all these dolls. She even has a book here, $19. Look at this. She just launched with Target. You see, and they froze the assets. Oh, no, sweetie, please lawyer up. Please, do I need to call one for you? I'm trying to find your city and state. Please lawyer up today. Uh-uh, nah. We need to know. Why you didn't check this out before? She just launched for Target. They're probably trying to hurt her, so maybe she can't. This is crazy. Can't do banking. So I'm assuming they have a bank elsewhere and in business. Sometimes it's good to have more than one bank, I'm just saying. But look at this here. She's also been seen on, oh, sounds, I sent some haterade with Wells Fargo. Good morning, America. People, the Kelly Clarkson show, Ted, Time, Nickelodeon, For girl, you on Forbes. Forbes, Black Enterprise, oh, the Oprah magazine, ABC, NBC, CBS. We're going to have to go ahead and, and put Wells Fargo to the test. What's going on? This sounds real shady to me, but you're not going to stop success. A 12-year-old CEO. Here's Zoe. Here you go. Wow. Created by a girl to empower girls. It was founded by a seven-year-old beautiful girl, Curly Me, is a mission to instill and inspire confidence in young black and brown girls through a line of beautiful black dolls, books, puzzles, and empowering content. For every doll purchased, one is given to a young girl in need. Wow. Give the gift of confidence every day. And when I was when I was born, I get, my first doll, of course, was a black doll. Straight up. So this right here. Wells Fargo, they've seized the assets. This look, look, she has a new collection at Target. What seizing the assets, and you know banks use money typically to invest. They might be sitting up here making money off her money. So this I'm gonna be calling today. Again, I found a number for Wells Fargo, 1-800-869-3557. It's too early to call, but the number, 1-800-869-3557. I Googled that, and that shows to be a number for Wells Fargo's customer service. Oh, uh, let's see here. The CEO is Charles Scharf, Charles W. Scharf, S-C-H-A-R-F. Oh, yeah, so some phone calls on my, I'm going to be calling today. The COO is Scott Powell, CFO, Michael P. Santamassino. So she just got this lunch at Target, and they're going to freeze her assets, close the account. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Wells Fargo. Close, a 12-year-old black CEO. Trust and believe. They will hear from me. I'll be calling today, and I'll let you guys know about the conversation. But hey, we got to support her. The website, beautifulcurlyme.com. We will not be stopped. We're black women. We've been through what other women haven't gone through. We were here before, and no matter what they do, we're going to still be here. We're going to help this young lady. After all, we are built to last. So don't forget Wells Fargo in case you want to call and inquire like me. The customer service number I googled, 1-800-869-3557. Thanks for watching. Please, let's support this young lady. Again, she just launched in Target. I smell a hater ray. They might be looking at her bank account and salivating on it. Yeah, we, we need some answers. We need some answers. Thanks for watching. Feel free to comment, like, subscribe, and share. And please, if you can, support beautifulcurlyme.com by making a purchase. It would be greatly appreciated. Love you all, and I'm out. Oh, hell no. I'm going to call.